I recently began selling products with Shopify and loved it so much that I helped a friend with her own store to set up on Shopify. The ease of creating a store and immediately beginning to sell your products makes Shopify one of the best platforms for selling online today. In this video, I will cover everything you'll want to know about Shopify, how to get started with your own Shopify store, and why you should be using Shopify if you want to sell products online. So to start, let's talk about Shopify. It is an online platform that allows you to build your own online store where you can sell sell physical or digital products. You might be wondering, is Shopify legit? I've heard reviews of it. I've seen it. The stock is skyrocketing, but is it actually a good product? Does it help people set up stores? And the answer is yes. Shopify manages to create making your own online store easy, but also robust, which is why it's trusted by over a million businesses. In fact, large multi-million dollar businesses like Harry's Razors and Gymshark use Shopify to power their stores, as well as many small businesses and online content creators. Shopify offers customizable themes to make your storefront look just the way you want it, and they also offer apps and tools that put it far and away above any other competitor. From inventory management to email marketing, Shopify gives you all of the tools you need to make your store a success and to grow with your business plan. So how does Shopify work? It works by providing both a front end, basically what your customer sees, and a back end, what you see and manage behind the scenes. Your customer will see your beautiful and streamlined storefront when they are shopping, and once they've made a purchase, all interactions will continue on the back end where you control everything. In the very, very comprehensive back end of Shopify, you have control over your products, inventory, pricing, orders, payments, analytics, finances, and more. Pretty much everything you can imagine. Shopify gives you every tool you might need and then some that you probably won't even use at first. In addition to all of this, Shopify has an app store with plugins for every possible thing you could think of to add to your shop and to customize it to do exactly what you need. So who is Shopify for exactly? It's for all aspiring sellers, all the way up to large multi-million dollar businesses that sell huge amounts of products. Shopify has pricing plans that range to suit all sizes of e-commerce companies and their starter plan makes powerful online selling possible for small shops and individuals. You can open any number of types of stores with Shopify. You can open a traditional e-commerce store to sell your products from your regular shop if you have a physical location. You can open a Shopify store to sell digital products online. You can open a Shopify store to do drop shipping where you don't handle any of the product, but another company ships it and stores it for you instead. There are all sorts of ways to create Shopify stores. And if you are eager to grow a large store or create a huge brand, then Shopify is definitely a great place to start because it's got all the tools you need to grow with you as you grow your business. So let's talk about Shopify pricing. Shopify costs vary depending on which plan you use. There are three prices pricing plans currently offered. $29 a month for basic Shopify, which is all of the basics that you need to start your new business or just get started online selling if you have not done it previously. Then $79 a month for Shopify, which is everything you need to grow your business and start scaling. Then $299 a month for advanced Shopify, which is all of the advanced features for scaling your business and growing to a huge multi-million dollar company. And right now when I'm filming this, in 2020, they are offering 90 days for free, which is an amazing way to get started. That is huge. They normally only offer a 14 day trial. So if you're watching this later, you may only be able to get a 14 day trial. But right now you can sign up, set up your store, and then pick a payment plan later once you've settled in and got everything up and running. This is a fantastic offer and allowing people to jump into e-commerce upfront without any cost or risk for three full months. So one of the things that people can grumble about when selling online are fees. So let's talk about Shopify fees next. If you can't tell from the basic pricing model with Shopify, it means there are no additional platform fees for selling your products. This gives Shopify the edge when comparing it to other store building platforms because it caps the amount of money it takes for creators from where... Uh, the, and that allows store owners to keep more of their money when they sell a lot of products. There are going to be payment processing fees when you sell on Shopify, but that is true of every platform you use to sell online. 
In order to accept any payment online for your products, you're going to have to pay someone, some company to process your payments. That might be in the form of incorporating PayPal or Stripe or another payment processor. And this is part of Shopify payments as well. So if you've made it this far, you're probably wondering, do I recommend Shopify? And the answer of course is yes. If you can't already tell from this video, I do really like Shopify, especially as an alternative to something like Etsy. It's truly the top option when you're trying to create an online store and go bigger and create a brand and a long lasting store and brand for yourself. It's easy to use and it lets beginners start a shop in no time at all. It's so, so simple. I will leave a link down in the description box for you to do their trial and set up your store. It's super simple. It takes literally less than 10 minutes. They also have an amazing support team. They have room for you to grow and they have a lot of features that are off with each plan. Beyond all that, the actual sheer amount of flexibility and features that Shopify offers blows away every other online store platform. I have tried out several different ones, Etsy, WooCommerce, Shopify, all sorts of different ones. And I do recommend several for different reasons, but if you're aiming for the most robust, comprehensive platform, I highly recommend Shopify because they have everything you will need. They do multiple payment options, multi-channel selling. They have abandoned cart recovery. They just have so many different features and options. It makes it the top option when you're comparing different platforms for creating your online store. So I have done a video on how to move your Etsy shop from Etsy to Shopify. They have automatic import and it is super, super easy. So I will link that down below in the description box and share it so you can move over from Etsy to Shopify if you're interested. It is super easy to get started on Shopify. So if you plan to start a store, I would recommend you get started with the free trial and have your shop up and running in a couple minutes and then take the either 14 days or 90 days depending on when you started and play around with how you can use your shop to better optimize everything and get it the way you want. There are also all sorts of people that can help you get a shop started and also get your shop customized and looking the way you want it. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. I love working with people on Shopify. Like I said in the beginning, I did help my friend get set up on Shopify and I'm always willing to help people if they need a little bit of guidance there. So just feel free to reach out and I hope you enjoy creating your online store and I hope this was very helpful in giving you a quick rundown on Shopify and figuring out if it is worth it for you or not.